what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here recently in an interview uh halloween three star tom atkins teased the return of the gentleman that you see on screen right now sheriff bracket who was portrayed by uh charles cypher in the original halloween from 1978 tom atkins starred in halloween three season of the witch i believe he was the main character uh, I'm not really too familiar with Halloween 3 Season of the Witch. I've seen it about 10 times, but that was 10 times when I was like around the ages of 5 and 6. And since then, I've watched it like sporadically across the uh, year. Sometimes I include it in my marathon. Sometimes I don't. I just don't watch any of the movies that don't have Michael Myers in it. And Halloween 3 is that movie, so I don't watch Halloween 3. But Tom Atkins, the star from Halloween 3 Season of the Witch, he recently teased or kind of hinted at the fact that um, Charles Cypher could be returning as Sheriff Brackett in Halloween Kills. Now, this is interesting. This is an interesting development because if this is in fact true, I just want to make I just want to make this plain and plain and clear. This hasn't been confirmed, nor has this been announced by Blumhouse or anyone involved with the project, nor did Tom Atkins say concretely that Jason Blum or anyone from Blum House got in contact with Charles or anything like that. So all the news report outlets that are running with this and confirming it as fact, I think we all need to slow down. That's not the case. There is no confirmation that any of these people that we have been reported of returning, coming back, there's no confirmation of that. The only person we know is coming back at the moment is, of course, Michael Myers uh, and Laurie Strode and Laurie Strode's two her two, uh, the two ladies with her, her granddaughter and her daughter. There's no confirmation on Tommy Doyle and there's no confirmation on Sheriff Brackett. However, if Sheriff Brackett is in this film, which I hope he is, I would like to see Charles Cypher reprise his role and it will be an interesting development. And that kind of tells me a lot about the possible direction that the movie goes in because I can't see, uh, the, f I can't see Annie's father. Uh, cause if you, if you remember the, from the original film, uh, Annie was among one of the victims that died in the uh, massacre that Michael Myers went on. Not even a massacre in this case. He killed like three or five, six people. I guess you can consider a massacre. Just a killing spree that he went on. Annie was a part of that. She was the daughter of Sheriff Brackett and the friend of Laurie Strode. Now, for the last 40 years, I, you would assume that Brackett has been just as distraught and heartbroken and maybe he's gone through some mental stuff just the same way Laurie has um and he's been waiting for this opportunity to get back at michael myers for taking his daughter or maybe he just been hoping right along with her that maybe one day he would escape or maybe someday he'd get an opportunity to get back at him now that the opportunity presents itself i would imagine that this would now mean that halloween kills is going to take place in the same night as the last movie because realistically i can't see sheriff bracket waiting years later after the last halloween movie um and now finally deciding to turn up and get revenge on michael if Sheriff Brackett is coming back. I think realistically, it sh this means that the movie is going to be set in the same night as the 2018 film. Because I don't see why Sheriff Brackett would wait so long now to come back. That's assuming that the next movie is, let's just say the next movie is set years later after the 2018 film. Why would Sheriff Brackett now all of a sudden show up now? Why didn't he show up in the 2018 film? Of course, they'll come up with excuses and stuff to that effect. But... Everything regarding Brackett and his motivations would just hint to the fact that he would want to get involved with it on the night of Halloween that Myers escaped in, not that he would want to do this years later. Um, I just hope that this means that the next movie is set in the same night. If it is a confirmation down the road that Brackett is involved, that's fine. Even without Brackett's involvement, the next movie needs to be set in the same night as the last film. Uh, if Charles Cyphers comes back, that is a great addition to the cast. I haven't really seen him in too many projects outside of Halloween and then one episode of Buffy the Vampire Slayer because I am a huge fan of that show. Um, I probably saw him in a few other things when I was little, not just Buffy the Vampire Slayer, but I probably saw him in a few other things and just didn't realize it. But let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section below. Would you like to see Charles Cyphers back? Would you like to see Sheriff Brackett back? 
uh what other characters do you hope come back for halloween kills let me know down in the comment section below if you haven't already make sure you subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video in the description i'll have links on my social media accounts on my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there to let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you would like me to cover in the future with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video